Hey, over the years, I've worked really hard to earn this reputation as the wimpiest of the reporters on the staff. So racing down this mountain at 40, 50 miles per hour, not really my bag. And I, I'm afraid we're about to find out why. Since the first T-Bar was installed in 1947, Whitefish Mountain Resort has built a reputation as a skier's mountain, a low-key whistler with 300 annual inches of snow and 3,000 acres of skiable terrain. Once you get up here and get spread out, you feel like you have the mountain to yourself. But there's more than one season of fun on what locals still call Big Mountain. From June through September, there are all kinds of daring ways to get downhill. And that explains why I'm looking just a tad nervous. <sighs> Most people get over their fear of heights. Whoa! Oh, we are getting some speed now. And you'd better get over your fear. Whitefish offers a seven zip line tour with rides up to 1,900 feet long and 300 feet above the ground. I am not proud of this moment. How did he do? That was awesome. They did really good. He kind of has to say that. I know we've had zip lines on our show before. And I don't know if TV does it justice. It's just flying and it's exhilarating and it's fun. Tell my mom I'm over. Here's another fun way to get down the hill, the Alpine Slide. It's fun for kids of all ages, really. A lot of grown men lining up for this one. I forgot to get a selfie, but I was smiling just as much as our photog Diane. Woohoo! Mountain biking might be the most popular way to get downhill, but if you're more interested in climbing up, you did meet some pretty sweaty hikers, and there's the Aerial Adventure Park, an obstacle course in the trees. Since you go through at your own pace, and it's really, really fun, and so you get to challenge yourself a little bit there. When you're through with the challenges and just want to relax, consider staying slopeside at one of three treehouse chalets. Developer Gail Goodwin says her snow bear chalet can sleep up to 10 people. The best room of all may be at the top of the turret, where 600 fiber optic twinkle lights form their own constellation. When you're sitting up there, having a glass of wine, watching the skiers go by, you're about 12 feet from the actual chairlift, eye level, an exquisite way to end a day of fun on the mountain.